Elena suffered a concussion, or at least that's what everyone thought, but it turned out that she hit her head so hard that she was bleeding internally and was gonna die. Meredith gave her vampire blood to save her, but didn't tell anyone because she didn't want to freak anyone out. What the hell is going on, Matt? I'm getting you out of town, Elena. Matt decides to take her out of town to keep her safe, and because of Rebecca, they get into a car accident. <laughs> She actually drowned, and because she drowned and died with vampire blood in her system, <laughs> she came back to life as a vampire. The fact that Elena's becoming a vampire is almost like a coming-of-age story, in a way. It's her, it's her transition into adulthood, and she's gone through so much. She's been forced to grow up and be an adult for a long time. She's been taking care of Jeremy and, and being the woman of the household, but now she's really independent she has, she's independent she's stronger and she's been getting stronger but now she's a vampire and she's gonna have to learn to to begin this next phase of her life kind of like growing up